In this video lecture, we are going to talk about adjectives and its types. Let's start with the definition of an adjective. An adjective is a word which adds something to the meaning of a noun or pronoun. Means it tells the characteristic of a noun or pronoun or any other noun phrase. These are generally found after the linking verb or before the noun it modifies. For example, I have many books. In the sentence, book is a noun and many add meaning to this noun. Next example is that dog is black. John is an intelligent boy. In all these examples, many black and intelligent are adjectives that describe the quality of books, dog and boy respectively. Adjectives answer the question what kind, how many, which one, how much. So this is all about the definition of adjectives. There are various kinds of adjectives. First one is adjective of quality, adjective of quantity, demonstrative adjective, proper adjective, adjective of number, distributive adjective, interrogative adjective, and possessive adjectives. So these are different kinds of adjectives. In the next, we will discuss one by one. The first one is adjective of quality. We can also say it a descriptive adjective. Adjective of quality shows the kind of quality of a person or thing. Means they show the quality or count kind of noun or pronoun. Such as a clever girl an honest man. Here clever and honest describes the quality of girls and men. So generally adjective of quality answer the question of what kind. It is further divided into two categories. The first one is attributively in which adjectives come before noun. For example, the red flower is lovely. Another category is predictively, in which adjectives come after linking verb. This shirt is black. So in this sentence, adjective comes after the link verb is. Next is the adjective of quantity. It describes the number or quantity of noun or pronoun such as every student, little milk. Adjective of quantity answer the question how much and how many. For instance, they have two children. It answer the question how many means how many children. It answer the this question. In the next example, she ate some rice. It answer how much, how much she ate. She ate some rice. So this example answer the question how much. Next one is demonstrative adjective. A demonstrative adjective directly refers to something or someone. Such as this, that, these, those. The demonstrative adjective in a sentence will come just before a noun or pronoun it modifies. It is totally different from demonstrative pronoun because in demonstrative pronoun it works alone and does not precede a noun. For example, for demonstrative adjective, this girl is pretty, that pen is green. Next is proper adjective. Adjective formed from proper nouns are called proper adjective. In general, Proper adjectives are commonly used to say that something is related to a specific person or place. It includes words such as Indian, Chinese, Islamic, Japanese and many more. 
For example, I love to eat Italian food. The American professor is teaching in the class. In these examples, Italian and American refers to specific noun Italy and America respectively. Next adjective is the adjective of number. Adjective of number show how many person or things are meant. This adjective represent numerical value. It is further categorized into two type. One is definite when they express an exact number such as 10 girls, 4 throw, 2 chairs. Another category is indefinite. Indefinite when they do not express an exact number. For example, all twice, many books, several people. Another adjective is distributive adjective. Distributive adjectives are used to refer to members of a group individually, such as every child, each day, either candidate. For example, neither statement is true. Every girl was happy. Distributive adjectives answer the question which one of number. So this is about distributive adjective. Next is interrogative adjective. Interrogative adjectives are used to ask question such as what, which, whose. An interrogative adjective must be followed by a noun or a pronoun. For example, what time is it? Whose car is this? Last one is possessive adjective. Possessive adjectives are often used to express possession or ownership. It suggests the belongingness of something to someone or something, such as my uncle, our books, her husband. All these adjectives always come before a noun. For example, her dog is very adorable. My car is red in color. Here, the noun is dog and car, so possessive shows the belongingness of that person or thing. Thanks, thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos.